we stay here now, we're going to talk about the relationship between words. So here we're not analyzing the meaning of separate words or separate phrases or separate sentences, but we're analyzing the relationship between words. After kelimeler arasındaki ilişkilere bakacağız. Kelimeler what kind of a relationship do they have? Right? For example, Sanana, Anton, eş anlamlı, zırt anlamlı olması veya işte aynı gruba dahil olması gibi anlam bakımından birbirleriyle ilişkiler. So when we're talking about relationship, this relationship is considered in terms of meaning. Alright? An anlam açısından or some other aspects that we really want to look into. So not only can words be treated as containers of meaning or as fulfilling roles in events, they can also have relationships with each other. We're characterizing the meaning of each word not in terms of its component features, but in terms of its relationships to others. Okay? So, synonym. Two or more words with very closely related meanings, if they are not exact meaning, precise meaning, closely related meanings. Yani, Eş anlamlı kelimeler dediğimizde tamamıyla bile bir aynı anlama sahip kelimeler anlamına geldi. Birbirine anlam itibariyle birbirine yakın olan kelimeler. Okay? Çünkü bazen aynı yani yakın anlama sahip olmalarına rağmen birbirlerinin yerine çok anlam yok. Dolayısıyla bir, they can be replaced with each other. In sentences, you can use one word instead of in the place of another word. You can change, exchange them. Yani birbirinin yerine kullanılabilir. But this is not always the case. You cannot always do that. For example, almost merely big. Watch, road, one, buy, purchase. But of course, they are interchangeable. That means they can be replaced with each other, but that is not always the case. You cannot always do that. Right. For example, let's take this. What does road mean? It means Kenish. What does white mean? It means Kenish as well. So they have almost the same meaning. However, for example, I'll give you an example so to clear your mind. Imagine mind. Yani ülke çapında, değil mi? Ulus çapında. Ülkenin her yeri. Doğru mu? Böyle değil mi? So here, guys, national line. If we change, substitute, if if this word, why the substitute with it is synonym, which is road. Do you think that will be correct? No. Even if they are closely related in terms of meaning, they cannot substitute it for each other. Anlam itibariyle birbirine yakın olmalarına rağmen birbirinin yerine kullanılıyor. Türkçe'de de böyle. Yani bazı eş anlamlı kelimeler birbirinin yerine kullanılıyor. Hatta bazı dil bilimciler hiçbir kelimenin 
birbirinin diye bir kelimenin yerine geçemeyeceğini iddia ediyor. Yani çünkü dil her bir kelime üretmen bir şeyi vardır, bir amacı vardır, bir kanteksi vardır, bağlamı vardır, sebebi vardır. O yüzden kullanılmaz diyor. The idea of sameness of meaning is not necessarily total sameness. When we say they are, they are the same, they are same, that means they are not totally the same. Okay? One word can be appropriate in one sentence, in a sentence, but it is synonym would be odd. It would be, it would be not appropriate to use it instead of that word. So it means they cannot be substituted. All right. Sandy had only one answer correct on the test. One correct answer on the test. The word reply would, would sound odd. For example, instead of answer, you use reply. You, do, you should have said she had only one correct reply. It sounds odd, right? It doesn't sound okay. And kulağa hoş gelmiyor. Değil mi? Cevap tek doğru bir cevabı. Tek bir doğru cevabı var dediğimizde. Yani answer yerine. For, uh, in our previous example, we said root cannot be substituted. Sorry. Line cannot be substituted with root. Nation one. You cannot say nation, uh, national road. And here, road cannot be substituted with Y. In road agreement, you cannot say Y agreement. In the all Y world, all Y world, dünyanın her yeri. Okay. So here you cannot say in the whole broad world. Even if they are synonyms, they are closely related in terms of meaning, they cannot be substituted with each other. They cannot be replaced with each other. Regional differences, but of course, there are also some syn synonyms due to regional differences. Because in one region, one word is used, whereas in some other region, a synonym of this word is used. For example, in American English, you would say candy. Remember? By 50 cents? So it's a candy shop. However, in England, they would use sweets. Sheket. Not sugar. Do not confuse candy and sweet with sugar. Sugar is different. No, sheket. Sheket by them. Chips. Crisps, say chicken chips, but is it crisps in English? Diaper, diaper, huh? Breakfast. Breakfast. Nappy. Breakfast. What about breakfast? Ni kitane? Regional difference. Huh? Regional difference. Yes. Well done. Regional differences because in America we say diaper, and in England they say. Nappy, gasoline, and petrol. Petrol? Petrol. Yes. Yes. Petrol. Yes. 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 Petrol. Yes. 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 And what is Hump Petrol? <coughs> Oil. Oil. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Right. 